Hey guys, welcome back to Mass Effect. Uh, so in this episode, we're probably going to be uh, fighting against uh, a Japanese hentai monster, which is why we brought one of our squad mates with us to uh, to deal with that situation. Obviously, Rex. Obviously. All right, we just need to find this creature and determine what what it that is disturbing. Nothing's ever simple, is it? Invaders, your every step is a transgression. A thousand feelers appraise you as meat, good only to dig or decompose. I speak for the old growth as I did for Saren. You are within and before the Thorian. It commands that you be in awe. You enslaved the colonists. You destroyed their minds. I don't know what Saren wanted with you, but I just want you dead. The Thorian is a piece of this world. Extending across the land and back through the ages. You can no more kill it than cut the sky. Your blood will feed the ground with a new growth! Uh, do we have enough here? Uh, I guess we do. Fuck, where'd it go? <laughs> well, we have a problem. Ah, that's okay. So, I don't know why they don't use biotic abilities on these things, but I have to tell them to do it every time. That's okay, because I could just shit fuck them. By the way, I, I don't think it means anything to keep them alive. I think it only means something to keep the, um, uh, the colonists alive, which we've already done, so. Uh, rest in pepperonis. Thorian node. What the fuck? What, where's my sniper? Oh, it just wasn't making noise. Oops. I actually didn't shoot there, but yeah. Uh, maybe we should use Singularity. See what I mean? Like, I don't, I don't know why the AI doesn't do that, but they don't fire upon... They don't use their abilities upon these things. I don't, I don't know why. Uh, let's just blame someone. Fucking... Fucking EA. Piece of shit. Company. These things are incredibly fucking tanky. Yeah, this sound it really is cutting out though. <laughs> yeah, I'll just lift that fucker. I'll just fucking punch this thing. Fuck you, asshole. Okay, well it just barfed on the R. They are instantly passed out from that. Let me help you out, Rex. Actually, why don't you help yourself first by pushing him back? There you go. I a mic that only helps those who help themselves. <clears throat> Alright, you can wake up now, Lyra. Clear. <laughs> Clear. Now well, here's a Thorian neural node. I think it just said to spawn more overlords. I can tell. A few more of those, and it's in trouble. Uh, thanks a lot, Rex. Oh no, the person we easily dispatched of is back. Okay. I don't know why those aren't waking up. Maybe we should lift this guy? Yeah, let's lift him. I don't know why these things aren't waking up, but... I mean, we can't damage them, so... <laughs> Just do the fucking air. Alright. Let's, uh... Put, throw them back. Fuck this guy. Oh, what the fuck? She's over here the whole time. Oh no, 
She's using blue yeah. orbs on me. That's not fair. Alright, let's uh... Let's let you push him back. You must die. Well, I don't have to. I, lost I, I like to feel like it's an option. Okay. Maybe it's not an option. Okay, it's not an option. Fuck. Like, as I said, I'm gonna probably work on immunity now. Was I already going into it? What was I doing? Um, I was doing- yeah, I was doing it. Okay, good. I feel like- I, I don't think I ever used immunity- oh, I have tungsten rounds. Alright, fine, you guys win. I'll fucking use the fucking- fucking piece of shit fucker. Yeah, that one. Shredder rounds. The shredded rounds. Alright, we've already seen this. Was this the game I originally LP'd and I like, I skipped literally all the dialogue and then people got really upset with me? Alright. I feel like we should lift that. Especially the sniper rifle does really good with damage. I know so, some guy was fucking telling me in comments or something. Okay, for some reason I can't. What, is the art the art the art died? Alright, we might we might have rest in pieces. Can you throw her? Nope. I'm just dead. Yeah, I don't know why this part got so hard all of a sudden, but whatever. Honestly, half the problem is my people don't even use their biotic abilities. I I, I don't know what, why the AI just takes a shit here. Alright. You need to singularity over here. The fuck? Why are you shooting me in the back? Here's the problem. I can't even tell where the fucking Thorium is. Or, sorry, not the Thorium. Whatever the fuck her name was. That's great, because we, we used all this and they were just like fucking flying around. Where is Rex even? Oh, he's just like right behind me, the fuck? I mean, this works for me. Okay, maybe it doesn't work for me. Uh, no, we don't need to use anything here. Okay, just lift this asshole up. Fuck. Why is he on my ass? Fuck. Throw him away. Uh, yeah, alright. Let's just pretend he's dead forever. Actually, where did she go? Oops. I was enabling my sniper hacks. And I think I missed, uh, sniper hacks did not work. Alright, I saw one go into here, but it I think it just reached some kind of kill zone. Negative contact which I have not had happen in quite a while. Alright, let's go. Alright guys, there's a weapon blocker I need to hack. If I, if I shoot them one by one, they all go down. Alright, but this is a problem. Where is Singularity? It doesn't stay overheated for very long, though. There you go, that's one. Fuck, I missed. This is why I really like biotic abilities. The tech abilities are still pretty good, though. You see it? Oh, shit. Uh, yo, we're dead. Yo, I'm dead. Uh, yeah, the minute they, the minute they go near you, like real zombies. I barely lived there, by the way. <laughs> No, uh, actually, wouldn't give us any loot, would it? Really? All right, let's let's override this one. Um, all right. Time for revenge. Time for revenge. All right, there's one of the uh, Torian testicles. I would like to quick save. Yeah, but there's too many, sh too much shit near us. All right, let's just hope we don't die. I've never died anyway, so right, let's go over here, because then she'll have to come out. Oh, okay. I wish I could give orders, but I can't. Do singularity right there. Where the fuck is it? I can't even shoot. 
Where is she? Yeah, we need to lift her up, actually. Why are they all blocked? Okay, uh, we got nothing. We're just gonna have to shoot her until she dies. A strategy I've never attempted before. Lyra is all tuckered out. All this fucking 28 days later shit. Got him. These things are actually particularly dangerous on this difficulty. Fucking hell. Alright, let's get up there. That's okay. You're welcome to take naps once in a while. It is the best team for this, because they're all biotic abilities. I mean, can't we just shoot that? You know, I just noticed we didn't we don't we did not get any more grenades. I feel like I should just shoot this node. Okay, maybe not. If only I had some sort of like explosive weapons. Rex is just kind of being useless here, that's fine. The thing, the thing that makes this really bearable is the fact I have um, overheated weapons. I was going to say, the sniper rifle knocks them back, which is amazing. Uh, it's overheated again. There's something up with the sound channels, because it just randomly cuts out the sound. <laughs> I missed. Uh, I did. Alright, get up. I own Wake up. Smell the ashes. Oh, well, it's dead now. Uh, is she making a return one last time? Yes, she is. Alright, I got her again. Yo, we get experience every time we kill her. That's some incredible shit right there. Dude, this guy like did like a fucking like, uh, like flipped his legs around. It's amazing. Damn it. Alright, we actually gotta answer this shit now. That knockback is super strong, though. Making sure. Oh, I'll actually have a radar for this. Fuck, I missed. Fuck, I missed again. <laughs> this janky ass combat. Alright, someone fucking died. Alright, everyone's dead. They already started shooting me, I thought the Asari clone was still up. This is like the only level I think I've seen so far that the sound just starts cutting out randomly, it's really weird. Is there like some sort of option here that I need to set for the sound? I mean, I have hardware audio, I'm not sure what the fuck that does, but... Uh, maybe that's the problem? Fuck it, it's the only time it ever happened in the game, it's not that annoying anyways. Alright, oh, medical station. Easiest decryption of my life. Omni tool, uh, a, a chameleon tool. It's chameleon, I know. But someone's triggered, so that's all that matters. Yeah, we've gotten no biotic amps at all in this game, like ever. I, I, I'm starting to think that they're a myth. All right, let's go. Singularity, that. So I'm straight. I'm starting to see how the. Knock that guy. Knock that guy's ass back. I'm trying to see, by the way, how the, the spacebar menu works for this shit, because I'm actually forced to use it. It looks like when they use it themselves, the um, it basically uses it from themselves kind of thing. It, it the sources them. And when I tell them to use it, the source is me. So they'll literally do it where, like, they'll do it through walls and shit. No matter what. Which is actually really stupid when you think about it. Yeah, sniper rifle really makes this easy, doesn't it? I mean, it's still tedious as fuck, but yeah. It's 
kind of a tedious part of the game, I won't lie. Don't wake up, you fuckers. Oh, wait, there's one right here. It's probably gonna wake up now. Yeah, I fucking knew it, too. Why just kill the Thorian though? Let's see what happens. Oh, they all die. Good. Hey, you wanna, you wanna wake up? We are. We kind of need you. Whatever. I well, I could unity her up, but I don't think it's worth it. Let's try to just walk back this way. Cause usually when you're far away enough from the combat, it registers you as not being in combat, and she gets up. We're, we're we're still trying it. I'm try I'm trying to do out a, a unity, you know. All right, it doesn't appear like it. No, it's not gonna work. Fuck. All right. Oh shit. I've lost shields. I've lost shields. Do we have abilities to use here? All right, I think we just lost. I think I see death right there coming towards me. Run. Oh, uh, we have a problem. One sniper shot to rule them all. Okay. Uh, I did Unity, and Rex is still down. I'm not sure why I did that. I think I have to press uh, my other ability. You know, it just occurred to me, I have a new ability here. It's dampening, and I did not put it on the hotbar at all. Uh, what's this one do again? It's like, uh, disables enemy biotics and tech within a certain maze. That's actually pretty good. Because I imagine that makes, uh, you know the annoying enemies that we face in the game so far that have, like, uh, their own immunity? Uh, because I could just turn that off for them. Alright, Rex. Get up, my son. Uh, it looks really janky, actually. Oh, fuck, I missed. Fuck, I missed again. The fuck is he going for, Figaro? Fuck. This is not in the, this is not how the Japanese animes go with, uh, with Rex at all. That's not how they're supposed to go. Alright, I think we can go kill its ass now. Like I said, I don't think it does anything later in the game, and if it does, well, I apologize, but I think you're just supposed to save the colony. And we're saving it. And I don't really think you get much of a choice with regards to uh, how you deal with this stuff. That thing has to drop soon. I would like to save. We never get to save. Ah, uh, here we go. Uh... Can you throw him away? Ah, uh, she fucking died. Okay, we kinda need to go head backwards. We need to advance in the other direction. Uh, do we have unity up? No. Let's uh, see, sorry clone again. Well, maybe we should give her the good old five. Uh, I didn't mean to hack. Use every tech ability. Alright. Don't worry, I'll hold them back with sniper rifle and shit. Okay, no we're not. I mean, I can just hold them right here, shit. I really feel like I should unite them up, but at the same time... Sniper rifle strong, man. Okay, how many, th how many Thorian Creepers do you think I can keep back with just a sniper rifle? And the answer is, apparently all of them. Infiltrator, best best class. Okay, except when it overheats. Oh fuck. Uh, yeah. We may need to unity this. Where's the fucking hole that we can go into? Maybe I'll go over here. Uh, yeah, that's much better. You get a soul of the campaign with this shit. <laughs> I 
Alright, yeah, this is, this is how I'm gonna deal with the zombie apocalypse, by the way, right here. I'm gonna deal with an infinite ammo sniper rifle that just knocks down zombies, apparently. By the way, if it did not do this, this would be a fucking ton harder. I'd be kiting them back and probably maybe caring about my squad mates' well, well-being, you know? Th things that aren't normal for me. You know, and then I'd like keep them, make them, make them stay alive and shit, you know, and deal with my problems for me. I didn't even have to pop uh, immunity for this. I never felt like I was in actual danger, uh, except for the one time I ran like a like a little pussy like in the corner, but that's that's fine. Uh, that that uh, that's obviously getting edited out of the video, so just yeah, you're gonna see just the fucking black blur of like the I don't know. Wait, why, why, does it, why can't I hit the, the neural node? The fuck? Why can't I hit it? Oh shit, she's right there. Yo, is this enough biotic abilities you're using? She's not even there anymore because you guys made it a fucking zoo. Good job. Oh wait, no, that's the wrong one. What the fuck? Uh, I don't know, fucking eat shit. Fuck is this mess? I would like to really hit this thing though. Alright, well we don't even have a bar for it right now. Alright, well it's just me and Rex versus the world then. Just shoot a couple of these guys and then deal with them. Yo, can I can I shoot this thing in its testicles? Holy shit. How many are left? Just two? Alright, let's just walk through it. Let's put immunity on. Where's that unity? Yeah, that's immunity. There you go. Easy. I should thank you for releasing me. Uh, yo, I didn't expect this. One sec. All right. Good thing I looked it up. How did you end up inside that thing? My name is Shiala. I serve. I, I served Matriarch Benezia. When she allied herself with Saren, so did I. Benezia foresaw the influence Saren would have. She joined him to guide him down a gentler path. But Saren is compelling. Benezia lost her way. You chose to side with Saren. So did Matriarch Benezia. Benezia underestimated Saren, as I did. We came to believe in his cause and his goals. The strength of his influence is troubling. Benezia sought to turn the river and was swept away. Asari Matriarchs are among the most intelligent and powerful beings in the galaxy. How could one fall under Saren's control? Saren has a vessel. An enormous warship unlike anything I've ever seen. He calls it Sovereign. It can dominate the minds of his followers. They become indoctrinated to Saren's will. The process is subtle. It can take days, weeks, but in the end, it is absolute. I was a willing slave when Saren brought me to this world. He needed my biotics to communicate with the Thorian to learn its secrets. Saren offered me in trade. I was sacrificed to secure an alliance between Saren and the Thorian. That's what you get for trusting Saren. Saren is quick to betray his followers, and his allies. Once he had what he needed, he ordered his Geth to destroy the Thorian. Saren knows you are searching for the Conduit. He knows you are following his steps. He attacked the Thorian so you could not gain the Cypher. What's the Cypher? And why did Saren need it? The beacon on Eden Prime gave you visions. But the visions are unclear, confusing. They were meant for a Prothean mind. To truly comprehend them, you must think like a Prothean. You must understand their culture, their history, their very existence. The Thorian was here long before the Protheans built this city. It watched and studied them. When they died, it consumed them. They became a part of it. Just give me some plain answers. Where is the Cypher? The Cypher is the very essence of being a Prothean. It cannot be described or explained. 
It would be like describing color to a creature without eyes. To understand, you must have access to endemic ancestral memory, a viewpoint spanning thousands of Prothean generations. I sense this ancestral memory, the cipher, when I meld it with the Thorian. Our identities merged, our minds intertwined. Such knowledge cannot be taught, it simply exists. You taught Saren, you can teach me. There is a way. I can transfer the knowledge from my mind to yours, as I did with Saren. Try to relax, Commander. Slow, deep breaths. Let go of your physical shell. Reach out to grasp the threads that bind us, one to another. Every action sends ripples across the galaxy. Every idea must touch another mind to live. Each emotion must mark another's spirit. We are all connected. Every living being united in a single glorious existence. Open yourself to the universe, Commander. Embrace eternity. I have given you the cipher, just as it was given to Saren. The ancestral memories of the Protheans are part of you now. A knowledge bond can be very traumatic. Are you all right, Commander Shepard? All I saw were more weird visions. It still didn't make sense. You have been given a great gift, the experience of an entire people. It will take time for your mind to process this information. We should get you back to the ship where you can be monitored. I'm sorry if you have suffered, but there was no other way. You needed the cipher. In time, it will help you understand the vision from the beacon. Do you know what the conduit is? Or where it is? No, I'm sorry. All I know is that Saren believes the conduit was the key to the Procyon extinction. That can't be good, whatever it is. You have the cipher. In time, your visions will clear. They will lead you to the conduit. I only pray you find it before Saren does. Is there anything else you can tell me about the Thorian? When the creature enveloped me, I became part of it. But I still don't truly understand it. So alien, so ancient. Its exact age is impossible to know. It measured time differently. 10,000 years of hibernation broken by a few frantic centuries of activity. Its mind was awesome, magnificent. It transcended all classification. And now it is gone. The galaxy's a better place with that thing dead and gone. The Thorin was a unique life form. A sentient being that lived for 50,000 years, maybe more. There is nothing even remotely like it in the known galaxy. I am grateful you saved me from a life of thraldom. Yet I cannot help but feel some sorrow for the loss of such a rare and remarkable creature. What else can you tell me about Saren? There is little I could tell you that you do not already know. He's powerful, he's charismatic, and he is dangerous. Once I followed him, blind to his true nature, but now I see he's leading the galaxy into an age of darkness and suffering. I want to know more about you. There is nothing remarkable about me. I was merely one of Matriarch Benezia's disciples. For nearly two centuries, I followed her, learning at her feet. When Benezia revealed her plan to join Saren, she gave her disciples a choice. Only those who were willing had to follow her. Many felt her plan was too dangerous. But I believed in her. I thought she could turn Saren away from his insanity. Instead, we joined him in it. Now that you're free of the Thorian, what are you planning to do next? If you allow it, I would like to stay here with the colonists. They have suffered greatly, and I played a role in their suffering. I would like to make amends. The colonists will need all the help they can get. They'll be happy to have you on their side. Thank you, Commander. May fortune smile upon you. I can't believe it. 
Jong says we'll have all the money we need to keep this place running. It's because of you, Shepard. I can't thank you enough. Alright, <clears throat> so the the reason I had to look it up on the, like, I had to stop for a second was because I wasn't sure what would happen if I, if, if I, I want to know if she returned to Mass Effect 2 and 3, and she does, so. Spoiler. Uh, but yeah, I just want to know if she came back and she does come back, so that's why I decided not to kill her. Uh, Alright, let's just put some points into some random ass shit. Sure, sorry scientist, that sounds good. What was I doing with him? I don't fucking remember. I think I did immunity for him, right? Yeah, I guess so. We'll just continue that. Maybe do like shotguns and stuff. So someone was yelling at me, they're like, Oh, she's only good at pistols. But she doesn't get anything related to pistols. So technically she's good with any weapon. Like, it's the same. She's shitty at everything in terms of weapons. She just doesn't get any like inherent bonuses. I just remember that from the comments like yesterday and I'm like, eh, I don't know. I will do what I can to assist the colony in this difficult time. I am ashamed of the damage done to the lives of these people. I have never kept this person alive. Farewell, Shiela. Farewell, Commander. I wish you well in your hunt. I, I will not even lie, I've never kept her alive. I've never saved this colony, I think. I think I just killed everyone. I'm like, fuck it. I fought so hard, but any thought of my own caused so much pain. Yeah, fuck you too. Ships are already on their way here with supplies. Any luck finding my workstation out in the ruins? I managed to find the data and transfer it to your OSD. That's very good news indeed, thank you. Just give me my credits and I'll be on my way. You bet. Thanks for all your help, Commander. Well, I can't, I can't double it? That data will be very valuable once I get out of here. All traces of the Thorian will be erased in short order. The Ramirez will have a second chance thanks to you. And he's like super Don't quiet. To see you survived your encounter with Athorian. Man, I wish I could have killed him actually. Alright, well, that's it. That's the best possible ending we could have gotten actually from that. Uh, assuming you want to keep people alive. I never thought I would be so thrilled to see a soldier. Forgive my previous inaction, but under the Thorian's influence, every thought was examined and filtered. What will you do now that the fighting is over? I may stay, try to recover my losses. I can have new supplies delivered within weeks. Perhaps the colony will survive after all. Let me see what you have in stock. Of course. Return in the future, and I may even have more to see. Uh, let's see. Uh, equalizer, sniper rifle. Yeah, it's all fucking garbage. We can probably just sell all this stuff, though. So I'm probably going to do that. Give me a minute. Alright, I basically sold most of my stuff, and, uh, yeah, nothing really else. I still have shredder rounds. I'll just keep them on. I basically just kept the best of the best uh, that I have, because this entire time I'm like, am I running out of inventory slots? And I don't know. Uh, I also put the regular grenades back on. I had the Thorin once, just got rid of them, so that's it. Thank you for everything you did. Uh, I don't think there's much else here. Thanks, Commander. It's great to be free again. Yeah, fuck you two assholes. I don't ever keep these people alive. So fucking, what's this fe warm feeling in my heart? Thank you for Fucking feeling good about helping people fuck? Need the cold blackness of space. It will take time for things to get back to normal. Thank you. Yeah, they didn't make much dialogue. I think uh, if you don't do a regular game... Uh, is this the way back, by the way? Oh shit, what the hell? Teleport. I assume this is the way back. Yeah, it is. Alright. Well... The colony is saved. I don't know why they'd want to stick here. Stick here because they'd be like they were stuck here forever. So like, time to leave the the colony. You know, fuck this place. Stand by, shore party. Decontamination 